So Mo, uh, first of all, congratulations on what was an excellent away victory. Uh, we drew three games in a row. And then today we've got a, an excellent away victory. What's your overriding thoughts on the game? So, uh, um, I, I just feel, I feel like it's been a few most weeks. But, you know, at the end of the day, sometimes you kind of control the result. You can, it's about controlling your performance is what you do in a game. Um, somebody hits it in the far post or hits it beyond the far post, you can't control. So I'm quietly, well, quietly kind of pleased. It's nice to go home with three points on Saturday night. But it's what the boys have given me every week. You know, whether you win or you lose, they've still given me everything. They're still in shape. And any team that plays us needs to earn it. And um, to come here and score three and potentially more by the way, yeah. Um, it's impressive for the talking about a couple of individuals, but first of all, real team collective performance was excellent. Middle to front, you know, their, their wing backs were excellent. Swanee came in today. Raz, I just thought the whole back, uh, the whole back line as well was excellent. The reason, the reason we've won the, the, the game today is for me, pretty simple. Vertical pressure on the ball. It's in your zone, you get pressed. Moxon never made a pass. Moxon's probably the best player in the league. He's not made a pass because of the way we pressed him, the way we set up to play against him. And the boys, listen, the boys are loyal. You can you can set up a team the way you like. If you don't get buy in and you don't get execution, then you get nothing. And, and the boys do it every week. I kind of I kind of thank them enough for what they've given me and give me every day. Um, so yeah, it's, it's it's a really good group. And anybody that comes up against us. Better play well to beat us. Yeah. I mean, just on to our attacking threat, I thought you've, you've kind of tweaked it a little bit with bringing in Quinny and Andy Barman playing mm. kind of as a 10. In terms of uh, Sammy Opryon's performance, which I thought was excellent as well, what, what, what do you think of that performance today? Yeah, I mean, you mentioned the front three, I thought the front three were excellent. But again, all the good play comes from good ball pressure and an ability or a, or a willingness to run beyond. Um, they, they, they worked tirelessly. But they did it in sync, they did it at the right moments. Um, so right running about like head was sick of have no place for that in my team. You've got to be efficient when you're running and understanding what you're doing and they did that perfectly good. And Sammy on Pro's got a big future. Yeah, yeah, and just moving on obviously we're still battling away. Um in terms of, of trying to get out there off the bottom, it's going to be difficult, but performance like that will obviously stand us in good stead. In terms of what the fans will probably be wanting to say is, you know, are we going to be in confident mood going into future games? I mean, obviously three draws and a win in the last four is really impressive form. Listen, I'm, a, I'm as calm as a Hindu cow. And the reason I have this calm, calmness is what I see every day in my frame of play. See, they, they give me everything, they do what they're told, they play me away with freedom. And to come away to Anna and score three. Uh, listen, I've said, I've said for about the last eight, eight nine weeks, we're not playing like teams down the way. We're playing like teams sitting fourth when they pressure. And that's due to character, that's due to, that's due to trust in what we're doing, um, trusting each other. And yeah, I, I, can't, I can't find the players enough. It's, it's really. But it's, it's top down. You know, you go into a football club, everybody's chipping in, everybody's helping. There's a level of honesty in a football club. But I hope I embody them as well. Um, and um, yeah, we're, we're on the single level. It's, it's going to be an exciting end to the season. Good. Well, thanks very much, Mo, for your time and uh, good luck next weekend. Thank you.